right, still in the test phase. I think it's working though. I think my voice is coming through as well. I see stuff moving. All right, that means we are indeed live for the second attempt so at streaming this game. It's not the second attempt; it's the second stream. First one was quite successful. Oh, and I forgot to turn off the sound on my monitor. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Oh, messing stuff up. Here we go. You hit me twice there. All right. Anyway. This particular game uh, is quite nasty because we got spot wiped twice. One was nearly Lodstone, our, our infamous Lodstone, more on, on him in a bit, uh, escaped as a sole survivor from our first terror mission. That was quite a story. And then we got squad wiped completely with the first batch of power suits uh, along with it when I tried to tackle a very large at night who was building a base. That base has never been found. It's, it's supposedly somewhere in Europe. We'll find it eventually at some point. Um, but that was a, a very heavy hit to the organization which leaves us with hardly any power suits. Actually like no power suits which is a bit of a shame to put it mildly. We have slowly recovered somewhat by building more laser rifles we're using some heavy plasma now we've got one alien grenade we still have stun rods I see uh, we are investigating UFO construction which I guess is a good thing what else were we doing it's been like what two three weeks um, oh yeah Africa is gonna be our second sky ranger base we quickly need a second sky ranger because after we got squad wiped um, I couldn't clean up the other crash sites from the UFOs that were building the base, so not only did we lose the men and the equipment, we also lost like three or four possible sites to loot, which leaves us uh, in shambles really. We've got 36 alien alloys and 59 Illyrium, and we are using that currently to build some power suits, but that's never going to be enough. We need UFOs, we need them quickly. Good news though. We do have a navigator. I think I pulled that off in like the last half hour of the stream last time. That was pretty awesome. So we can have hyperwave decoders in time. But yeah, it's not looking great. I mean, we are building up the bases pretty nicely. Um, we even have 2.6 million in the bank. We got most of the world covered on the radar net, especially once uh, Australia is done. But all in all, it's not looking great for a game that's well on the way. We're on the 23rd of April. The aliens will step up their game every single month. And currently we're bringing guys with nothing but, you know, the clothes on their backs. Oh yeah, our commander. The awesome story. When I started streaming, Lonston was the first guy to come in um, the previous session and got a soldier named after him. He got other soldiers named after him too, because at first I didn't have many viewers. But the original one continued to survive. He has survived for 10 missions. He's got 6 kills. He's been in sickbay quite a bunch of times. But he just won't die. He's got a bravery of 60, he's got a firing accuracy of 72, and he started off pretty damn good, so he's an awesome soldier. You can only dream that he's also psionically gifted if he gets that far. But yeah, he's 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 quite a miracle, really. He wasn't there for the squad wipe, because he was in sick bay, I think. He walked away from a near squad wipe. Let's get this in order. There we go. And he's still alive and kicking. Quite amazing. Uh, these are all the guys that uh, were named after the viewers from the previous stream. Once they die off, I hope I get viewers. So we can rename these fine people over here. I, su I suspect I will run out. Because, you know, no armor and everything. Who's the colonel? Vladimir. Also pretty decent. Cool. Well, there's nothing else to do, except hope that uh, aliens are kind of, you know, pushovers this uh, coming hour. And hopefully we can get some alien alloys and some Illyrium out of it, some loot to sell, and a lot of power suits to build, because, yeah, that's where it's gonna go. Either good or bad. It's this, this really stands or falls with the amount of power suits we can have. Here we go. I'm not going to gamble on any UFOs. I suspect some of these will be retaliating. Uh, Sky Ranger has 14 people on board. We checked. Actually, what is this? Medium Scout. Small Scout. 
Mm, I suppose it can gamble a little bit, but it's gonna be ages before the Sky Range actually gets here. Oh, it did land. I think we're gonna lose him. Damn it. That's too much gamble. I think I gambled like this the previous time as well. Yeah, we're gonna lose him. Damn it. Yeah, no more gambling. No more gambling at all. Damn it. Well, it landed, so... At least it wasn't retaliation, so it didn't find a base. My other PC died, sadly, so I'm using my laptop as my second screen. It's a bit uh, a bit of a hassle, because it constantly keeps going uh, on black screen. Yeah, let's see. No more gambling. Just kill it. Charlie, wipe it out. It's a medium scout. We're just gonna play it. Um, we actually need more alien allies than we need Illyrium at this point. Both are welcome. I'm gonna wait until first dawn. This is cool. We have plans for beams, don't we? Yeah. We just don't have any stuff to build it with, so... For now, I think Avalanche launches. Yeah, it's, it, it, it will do. It's pretty cool though, we have everything armed and everything's pretty well. Except for the power suit situation. There we go. Let's send in the boys for the first action of the day and I'm misclicking like crazy. There we go. Charlie, Lonstone. Let's see. Some of these pacifistic weirdos are carrying stun rods. We are here to kick ass and chew some bubblegum, guys. We're not here to stun aliens. We have our navigator. We can kill the rest with extreme prejudice. Silly people. This is better. This is more like it. Alright, we have some guys in power suits and some guys... Um, yeah, not so much. And of course, we land next to buildings. Look at this, look at this drop side right here. Look at this. Building, building, building. And there's the UFO. This is horrible. It really is, because aliens always tend to be inside these buildings. There goes Charlie. Which means we're gonna die horribly. It's just what it is, guys. How can we not see the guy that just shot us? I'm pretty sure he's just up there. We'll, we'll fire some holes in the in the roof. Because I, I know he's over there. Horst. Doesn't have enough time units apparently. I mean, you just know they're here. We just don't see him. I don't like this one bit. I'm not gonna unload all of the guys. Because it will get them horribly killed. How can we not see them? This is so spooky. Yeah, you guys can just move up a bit. How about that? Just move up a bit. And let's see what happens this round. Before I unload all of you guys and just have you here to be mowed down. It's sectites, not floaters. Doesn't really matter at this point. Both will die in one hit. And we don't die? That's very scary to me. There we go. Well, I've seen that being done better. I'm gonna plow through this building here. Well, at least now you can see him. We got some backup. Oh, let's click. I seem to be doing that a lot. Maybe I should change my setup here a little bit. Alright, at least we killed one. 
We do know there's plenty more than where that came from though. There was a bug in the old one where you could just stand on the um, little stack of hay and then see up top. I just wish we could see them where they are so I could just blow straight through these buildings and kill them. I think we should unload some more guys then. As much as I hate to do it. I mean, these are mostly rookies. They're not going to be, you know, they're not going to have much reaction fire going on. The last three remaining power suits. And they're out. I'm going to have our commander and colonel cow back a little bit because if these guys die, morale will plummet. And this is scaring me. This is just, I uh, know, I'm getting annoyed. Because you know that this is swarming with aliens and we don't see them. Really? This is empty? This is, this is freaking me out. How can this be, this be empty? too weird. It really is. Well, so far, it seems like we just have to converge on the UFO. That's all there is to it. Alright, Sothos, you can go around the building, go scout the back. And Vladimir will also lead the guys to the UFO. And I'm going to be very careful with Longstone here. You can just park yourself. Okay, one, one's out. We know where he's at. Behind the building. Eighteen. That's perfect. Nice. Hey, uh, comrade Suvorov. You say good evening everybody. I think uh, it's just you and me for the moment, buddy. I do hope more will join. We see one in the darkness. I don't think we can kill it though. Now, I'm not gonna step in. Because that'll be suicide. Although this guy might still come out and kill us. And if this is really empty, it'll blow my mind. Well, it looks like, like it is. That is amazing. Three buildings. No aliens. Wow. Yep, yeah, it is empty. This game is really throwing me for a loop here. they're all in the UFO. Which might be intact. We might get lucky here. That's exactly what it means. Exactly what we need, sorry. We need to get lucky here. We need the resources badly. Is this guy gonna step out? No, he didn't. Mr. Lingzu. It's the high vantage point. Eventually. Oh, cool. How can you not kill him? I think we let these guys just peek the door for a couple of turns. I think that's the safest way to deal with this. Yeah, I don't mind, or I don't mind it either, comrade. I just really feel like playing this game. Uh, my let's play of it is nearly done. I've recorded stuff until like March 11. And it is in the mind control phase, so it's the cheese phase. It's a lot of fun, but uh, the challenge is kind of gone. And this particular playthrough of XCOM has gone incredibly bad. I'm not sure if you remember the last time, but two s new squad wipes are there. 
We've lost pretty much all of our armor and our resources in that one. Meridian doesn't see anything. Well, Pete does. Nice. And you'll reinforce. I think they're all in the UFO, and I'm going to operate on the assumption that they are. Aim chop, please. Nice. You can wait just a little bit. Maybe that was not a good idea. Wow. It was not intact, or that grenade maybe blew up the Illyrium, but I doubt that. 34 alien alloys, and we lost, I think, two power suits. <coughs> Which is not ideal. However, badly needed experience for the men is also worth something. Sky Ranger 2. Such a sad state of affairs. There we go. You're wounded. Put you down below here. And we are building power suits, so yeah, we finished one for Olira there. Would you consider playing the Xenonauts? Yeah. Somebody gifted it me on, on Steam like ages ago and I still really haven't gotten around to it. Probably should play it. Ah cool, we have the um, large radar is done in Australia as well. So the radar net is now complete, except for the people on Hawaii and maybe some New Zealand people. And some little bit of jungle here. And it's a bit of a sloppy radar net really. I think I did it better in the Let's Play. I have a fast one, I got a money. I suppose we can sell this soldier, really. We don't need it. Plasma rifles. There we go. This is looking more comfortable. Gonna order some soldiers in the Sky Ranger here in 13 days. So far, so good. No more gambling with UFOs. These things are gonna die, and then I'm gonna just clean them up. Maybe I should research hyperwave decoders first. That will make the Illyrium hunt a lot better. Yeah, actually, let's do that. This is over the forest, but why the hell not? Another medium scout, large scout, I should say. I'm gonna clean it up during the day. Lots of misclicking. Jeez. Here we go. You're actually faster than the uh, dayline line. Daytime line, I should say. Is it completely the day? Yeah, it is. Alright. Alright, guys. Let's see if there's any more of those silly guys with stun rods. No, okay. We really don't need the stun rods at this point anymore. Oh! Because I have all the live aliens I need. Meaning, a navigator. Ooh, Snake Man already! Not too happy about that. But yeah, we, we know the aliens will step up the game constantly. Gonna meet more and more nasty vi variants of aliens all the time. All we can do is just hope and pray that we get some Illyrium quickly. Is this thing intact, maybe? No, not by a long shot. Not at all. Let's start the aggressive scouting. Alright, just move up the rest a little bit. The higher ranking office is coming to play in a sec. Wait, these are rookies. We got two rookies in the back seat, that's not good. Malcolm, down, damn it. 
Market needs to come on stream so you can get a new soldier. We're only gonna name them after active viewers, so there's no recycling if you're not here. Which means if uh, Comrade here is gonna be the only guy, you're gonna have ten soldiers. Alright, that's one down. There was another one shooting from here somewhere. I think. Yeah, there it is. It's a bit of a weird angle to shoot, I think, because of that hill. Nice. But shot made anyway. Oh, we see one. Can we make that angle with all the trees and stuff in the way? In theory. In reality, however, not so much. Not enough time units. Ah, oh, you already took your shots. Never mind. Hmm. Problem is, you're in the way. This would actually be a doable shot. If horse could aim. That's horrible shooting. What the hell is your stats? 60! You should be able to make these shots. In your sleep, man. 24 left. That's enough for an auto shot. Guys, if you don't kill him, he's gonna kill you. I don't have grenades to toss over this UFO, so it's, it's kind of up to the guys here. Scruffy. I can move you there and take some shots. Yes, well done. You've just cleaned the firing line for the alien so he can shoot you in the face. Well, our brave commander. It's time to show the soldiers how it's done. Good shot. Holy shit. Yeah, if I had grenades, I would probably toss it up here. Alright guys, good luck. Nice. Suppose it's only just one alien left then. Meridian, shoot him in the back, please. Damn it. Can I get an angle on him? This is one of the disadvantages of aggressive scouting. <laughs> I don't think I can get an angle on him. And this is this is eating away time units really quickly. I don't suppose you have an angle already, do you? No. Damn it. I do have one grenade, but I don't think it's in rotation, is it? I think it's like on the bottom of the uh, Sky Ranger. Flores has it. Ooh, that might work. Mm, maybe not. I suppose I can toss it to somebody else and then, you know, get it closer. That might work. Yeah, let's try that. Um, let's send it over to Olira. And you can prime it and throw it. Yeah, this will work. Damn it. I didn't want to kill my soldier. I actually did that pretty nicely. But it didn't kill the alien either this way. Hmm. Kinda wasted our one grenade. We're gonna need some reinforcements at the front because people are gonna start dying in a sec. Of course this is asking for a grenade in the face myself. I shouldn't do this. Hmm. Super Loo! You just signed up, sir. You're in the right place. Just keep on chatting. I do need more soldiers in a hurry. So it'll be in real quick. Good luck. Ah, oh, he can't throw a grenade anymore now. He can shoot Meridian in the back, however. And why are these aliens killing everything with a power suit? Bastards. That's the last one. Yeah, two dead. <coughs> Once again, we lost equipment. Precious power suits. 
Yeah, I think this is the best idea. Get those hyperwave decoders up real quick so we can just land next to UFOs and have to stop the gambling. Um, yeah, let's get the boys back home. And I think it's reached the point where I don't have enough named soldiers, so we should start naming. You guys to the front. You guys to the back. We have an unnamed one here. So, Mr. Comrade. What was it? Two, four, rough. You are in, sir. I think Olira is still there. Hey, Olira. Yes, you are still alive. You've made it to Squaddy in the previous mission, I think. We have a Suprilu. Were you still alive? Were you there last time? I don't even remember. I don't even brain. And that should be it for now. And I could order some more soldiers, I suppose, and back up. Let's do ten. Oh, you made the squad earlier. Did you get just the one kill then? He didn't even get a kill. <coughs> you just got promoted because you survived, I suppose. Yeah, you've been working out a little bit. Let's check out the new guys, actually. Where's Superilu? Superilu. Oh, you're not on the Sky Ranger yet. Hmm. Yeah, this is pretty piss poor. Welcome, though. And I'm very comrade. Yeah, also not the best. But they will improve with time. They will improve with time. Got 2.6 million. I can sell some crud, I suppose, again. Got two power suits to hand out. It's gonna help. These mine probes are just gold. I don't know why they're so expensive. I guess we sell them to shady organizations that use them to like extract information from people or something. Oh, I do have two plasma beams. That's awesome. I should have checked that. Yeah, of course I have not enough store space because I s got avalanche missiles incoming. That's stupid of me. I should have checked that. Oh well. Go to base. Sell this stuff. That's a good way to burn money. I got two plasma beams there. Thank you. Kill it! Over the jungle. Uh. Oh, sweet! That was quickly done! I got some good egg, egg, egg hats going on there, wow. Living quarters in Africa is done, but we need the... Uh, yeah, 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 this is a lot of stuff going on, hang on. Thank you. I really don't want you over the jungle. Then again, I've gambled too much. UFOs. Someone has the habit to not heal someone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, true. Oh wait, power suits. Yes. I'm probably more sloppy than, than usual. I know that sounds very scary, but it's, it's actually true because I'm a bit under the weather. Three power suits, cool. Good luck, gentlemen. Looking good. Let's go. Ooh, immediate targets. Scanning. Where the bloody hell is it? No line of fire. We do need to exit, I suppose. Maybe Flores has a shot. He does. Nice. Goodbye, Flores. Will you have the perpetrator inside? Mafatu, I did. Yeah, you missed the first one. First one was uh, uh, stop shooting the guys in power suits. 
two weeks ago or three weeks ago or something. Don't worry though, I've made backups of the files and they will eventually be uploaded to YouTube in their entirety. And I think I'll do that when my Let's Play is done. Soul, that is horrible gunnery. Soul is one of the best mech warriors I know, um, and I've known him for quite a while now. He's an awesome shot in real life. His soldier, however, is not. Comrade, there was some good shooting with some poor stats. It's impressive. Horst! Welcome, sir. I think you missed the death of your soldier. But uh, now that you're here, you're gonna get, get a new one. Olera, all power suited up. And Scruffy found something. Ooh. Luckily, the alien is a poor shot as well. Can we shoot it from here? Nice. Yeah, it's gonna be two hour long videos though, <laughs> Fatu. I think I'll just release one every week or something when the Let's Play is done. So people can still get their XCOM fix. I must say that this game right here, this playthrough, is a lot more interesting than my actual Let's Play that's going on right now because of the two squad wipes I've had. And also the story of our commander Lonstone here is quite impressive. It's an awesome soldier and he was the first one to be recruited. I kid you not. He was the first guy on stream the other day and he survived all this time. I don't know how, but he did. Oh. I am going to treat him uh, with a little bit more care though. Because I want him to survive as long as he can now, because he's, he's like this enigma. He's like this, con this, this weird anomaly in XCOM. The one that didn't die. Hmm. Nothing on the scopes yet. This is why I hate jungle missions, all the crud. They became less annoying now that I can, I can shoot through uh, terrain using the control button. That, made, that makes jungle missions actually a lot more bearable. The no line of fire crap was very real before Open XCOM came out. Oh, Horst, you're not you're not dead. Here you are, Sergeant Horst. Good soldier too. I bet he looks like you, doesn't he? Vladimir. Hi, hey, Juju. Yeah, this is very pew pew. I think you'll like it. It's got a lot of death and carnage and randomness in it. I know you're a fan of randomness. Hope you found somebody to play with this afternoon. I didn't make it into Mac Warrior, sadly. The Twitch was broken for like a good hour uh, completely this afternoon. The Twitch is being very twitchy. I know, Jojo, you're the most random Asian I've ever met. Can we get a visual on the alien? Yes, we can. We can even shoot him. And the face! Nice. Horst always volunteers for the most dangerous jobs. He's gonna explore the UFO without an armor. He's gonna be backed up by Olera, who's got an armor, but will be in the second line. Ooh, target. Shoot faster, damn it! Or just just hit him, you know? That'll help too. This is probably no line of fire. We'll make one. Alright, you do have the line now. Please use it. Damn it. John Cop. One John, one Cop. Here we go. Alright, you, you're doing well in destroying the nasty jungle. Close. Closer. Very close. One hit. That was one hit. That's cool. 
come on. Did I mention I hate jungle missions? I think I did, right? In case I didn't, I hate jungle missions. With a passion. With a freaking passion, I hate them. Uh, can Sol make this shot? Without killing his buddies? Probably not. You're not in the best spot there, Scruff. They're blocking everybody's line of fire. Chucking grenades is probably the last I'd thing I'd do with all this crappy foliage. Um. Ooh, close! Can somebody please hit him? <laughs> it's time to get annoyed. Ah, if nobody wants to kill the alien, then I suppose, you know, we'll just have to let him live. Can we do like an awesome aim shot thingy? No, there's no line of fire for you. And if I force it, then I suppose you're gonna kill uh, Mr. Comrade here in the back, or a Scruffy. This thing is gonna chuck a grenade, I know, it's gonna kill like five people. Thirty-two. Can you can you please please no? We have nothing left in the Sky Ranger either. Would be ideal. Good vantage point actually. Mm, let's go over there. We cannot kill this alien this round, so he's gonna kill some of you. That's just what it is. Now yeah, a bit of an angry ragey bunny today. Hi Kessler. Welcome, dude. Hey Ducky. Wow, he, did, he didn't kill any of you. It's amazing. If he would have just chucked a grenade, he would have killed like loads. Uh, I want to make sure. Very nice. If I step inside, I can shoot him. But that's certain death, so I'm not gonna do that. Nope. Lonestone, I want to be very careful with you. Um... Let's have a bit of a line, I suppose. Let's hope this guy doesn't start suicide bombing us. Alright, he didn't go outside. And he moved. This is not him. If he is, he's like the fastest sectoid uh, ever created. Nothing. Still no Illyrium, damn it. But only one death, so I suppose we're improving. Meat for the grinder. Sweet. So Prelu is in and at the front. We actually have some ranking guys. Cool. Let's see. Considering that I have some viewers now, let's uh, exploit that a little bit. Because I saw it El Ducarino in the chat. Let's see who else is out there that's not on this list yet. We have Eventual Wagon, but I know the actual name. Is Juju. That's how I know you. That's gonna ha that's gonna be how I'm gonna use you. You are the most crappy soldier alive, except for your aim. You have really good aim. Anything above uh, 50 is pretty good, and this is 68 to start off in. You are an absolute coward, with very little strength. Mm, you're quick though. It, it's kind of fitting, isn't it? You got a really good aim in back corner, you got a good aim here. Who else is not on the list and is chatting to me? Kessler. That should be Captain Kastler, I suppose. This sounds uh, very Dutch, Mr. Gerrit Bakker. Hey, your soldier's crap, not you. <laughs> Am I missing anybody? 
I think Galera Soldier is still. Uh... I'm a Fato, yeah, I'm a Fato. Sorry, dude. What did you get? Firing accuracy 41. You're more of a threat to the team than to the aliens, really. At least you're twice as brave as Juju. Yeah, you, uh, just make, yeah, there you go. You got one. Uh, Super Lou wants to see his stats. Let's see, uh, this is where I left off naming. Super Lou. Where the hell are you? You're at the front, so enjoy the stats while they last. I suppose I have a power suit for you. Yeah. That's you! Firing accuracy 44. And uh, you should read the grenade, man, really. I'm pretty sure we picked you up from some baseball league or something. Throwing accuracy of 72 is nuts. And Ducky didn't see his stats. Alright, alright, where's Ducky? Average on all accounts, I'd say. Yeah, actually, you're, you're a poor shot. This is not the best batch of soldiers, really. I mean, you can start off with these kind of stats. 68. 51. 41. Uh. Oh well. And this is Lonestone. 30 missions, 7 kills, but I've been hanging him back now a little bit. Uh, making sure he lives. Awesome commander. Much respect. 9 days until Team 2 is being led. Oh, by the way, you can also apply for uh, pilots. Charlie, for instance, is an interceptor pilot. I still need somebody to fly the Sky Ranger. You like to think of your playing style as the Brave Pansy. <laughs> yeah. Hyperwave decoder is still unknown. We need a shitload of money for the Hyperwave decoders. And I do value them over power suits. I think we're fast running out of Illyrium. 34, which means we can build 6 more power suits, if I'm correct, and then we run out. We do have some stuff to, to sell, I suppose. I saw 3 mine probes there. That's some navigation crap. Money, money, money. Here we go. I think we doubled the amount of uh, aiding grenades that we have. Yeah, let's bring some explosives. Um, 12, that's pretty cool. Only six medkits are left after that squad wipe. No more stun rods, please. We don't really need them. Oh, actually, come to think of it, if we do encounter a like medium with sectoids, I want that leader. So let's bring the stun rods anyway. Let's hunt the leader. Six million, but it's gonna melt away as soon as hyperactive code has come. Germany's not happy. Well, they're, they're never happy. They're Germans. USA, Brazil, blah blah blah. Everybody else is happy. So it's the Germans are just whiny little bastards. Yeah, they, they actually reduced the funding too. How can they be unhappy and the rest of Europe is happy? I mean, seriously. What's going on there? We break even pretty much with the money. At the end of the month you get some money, but you also pay for all the like uh, wages for the personnel, um, the maintenance for all the buildings and stuff like that, and it seems to be just about what we make with the funding of the nation. So we, we really have to live off what we can sell. It is what it is. It's the month of May, which means the aliens will probably step up uh, to like mutant levels and stuff like that. Be prepared for some nasty missions. I'm quite content with the... we're gonna lose this one, yeah. With the amount of money that we have though, this hyperwave decoders will probably be done by like the start of next month, hopefully. Yeah, we have 14 guys in there. And no more power suits to hand out. I can give this one a little bit of time, I suppose. Because if it's landing, it's during the day in the desert, which are the perfect kind of missions. And it's very slow at the moment. I don't think it's looking for my base. I think it's looking for a site to land. Please land, I need Illyrium. Land, 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 come on. Yes, it landed. Sweet, this is what we need. 
Landstone, I know you're a pacifist at heart, but please get a gun. Same goes for Vladimir. What the hell's wrong with you people? We got no no horse CM alchemist. Come on. What the hell? Sothrus and Sothrus. How do I have two Sothruses? What happened there? Cloning machine had a little glitch, I suppose. John Cobb, Lingzu, Soul, Superlu, Longstone. None of the new guys are in this one yet. I should get you guys on the next mission. Remind me to put you guys on the Sky Range, otherwise your soldiers in there, but you know, you don't actually see them in action. Next mission, Juju gets the front. Hmm. Ominously quiet. No aliens anywhere? Really? Like for reals? How does that happen? Alright. I suppose it just landed, but they, they, they had like a good half hour to just step out. Okay, now we see it. <laughs> I think this is time for some aimed shots or something, if you have the time units for it. Otherwise, I, I do suspect you guys will shoot each other in the back now. Ah, we're one time unit short. If I start auto-shotting from here, we'll definitely murder people. Mm. I suppose I can do it from this side. Can I not? Maybe. No line of fire. Hmm. 26. I can auto shot now. It's a bit dangerous with the guy in between, though. Uh. Nice. Don't. Okay. Lingzu is alright. My laptop as a second screen works, but it's a bit small. Actually, I have to lean over to read the chat. I should change this setup maybe a little bit. Hang on. Let's move some stuff around here. I still need to like have some room for the mouse, so yep. This is hopefully a little bit better. Otherwise, I'm missing all the chat, which is kind of what it's about. Hey, Kilaja's in there. You got a decent gun. You got a heavy plasma. It's the best gun in the game. Hey, Lonstone. Oh, you're not that late for the party. I think I started like what half an hour ago. All right, this will do. Alien spotted. Was that a grenade? No. Alright, and we know there's one behind this building. I'm gonna try and if I, if I can spot it. Probably not. We probably should just destroy the building. Superlu has a grenade. Sweet. Let's gamble with that grenade. I know he's somewhere over here. Bullseye! That was right on the money. Oh. Ah! Right, that was scary. Um. No line of fire, and you got people in front of you too. Not that it's ever stopped us before. You can probably out a shot. No line of fire. Is that because of a comrade here? Hmm. I know there's another grenade somewhere. Hmm. No. No more nades. We can probably shoot through the building here. Yeah, let's let's just you know destroy everything in order to get to Olira. Let it rip. Yeah, the annoying part is you do need to you know aim. This is not gonna work. If I take shots with these people, we'll we'll kill the guys in front. I 
you could try one shot. Though. How do you not have a line of fire if you can hit him there? Ah, screw it. Good luck. Ah, that was a misclick on my part, damn it. <laughs> I actually clicked next to the alien. Oh, it's not going well. People are gonna die. Yeah, people are gonna die. Unless he just runs away. Wow, okay. Never considered that as an option. Comrade! You got lucky. Take him out. Damn it. Wow. Look, you only have to hit him once. It's not rocket science. Just shoot him in the face and he's gonna die. Like that. Okay, souls on the roll. Hmm, not bad. Was that it? No, there's still more. Holy shit! I'm not gonna chuck a grenade in here because I want this, this power source intact. Holy crap, okay. We're in a bit of trouble. Because this is gonna cost us the lives of a bunch of soldiers to clean out. Yeah, this is superhuman, so there's lots of aliens on these UFOs. Yeah, it's a good point. If I kill everybody off, the new guys will definitely make it to the Sky Ranger. But I'll just make sure that uh, the guys that are watching right now, you guys will be at the front at the Sky Ranger next time, and then we'll just recycle a bunch of soldiers with your names. Alright, good luck. Don't shoot the guy behind them. Uh, Alright, that's good. Wow. We actually got away with that. That was very dangerous for Mr. Comrade here. Can you shoot him? No, you don't have an angle. If I step inside, you're gonna die. 23, that should do. I know. Nice, Super Elu finished him off and that should be it. Wow, no casualties. 50 Illyrium. Illyrium, by the way, for the guys that don't know the game, is the fuel that the UFOs run on. And you can build all kinds of good stuff from this material, but the only way to get it is to get uh, an intact power source for the UFO, which we just did. Very important mission. We gambled a little bit on the fact that it was gonna land, and it paid off. Let's see, Ducky's watching. Juju's watching. Castor's watching. Mafato's watching. So you guys should be in. Soul's not watching. Lings was not watching. Scruffy's not watching. Mm, we have two Sothrases. That's a bit bit overkill. Let's get the sergeant in there. And let's go like this. Let's make sure we have the the first two guys with power suits. Still horribly short on this. Oh, Scruffy is watching! <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, no, no, then. So Scruffy's back. Sorry, Scruffy. Do I not have a Kilaja, Entropy, Sege, whatever soldier? That should be rectified. There you go. And let's take uh, let's take the alchemist out then I suppose. There we go. Yeah, that should be it. All right. Just checking just chat occasionally. That's why I'm phasing in and out. Uh, we can bring heavy plasmas for everybody. And no more silly laser guns for a while. Some more grenades harvested. And the power suits are distributed. Alright. 
14 guys in there and research is still unknown we do have Illyrium now so the power suits are gonna be built holy shit that came out of the blue I shut down all the UFOs so how the hell did they find my main base <laughs> holy shit well this is one that is if we lose this this is over this is a mission that just determines the cause the, the end of this particular stream holy shit at least they have no more bugs in this game that make your equipment like like bug out. Does everybody have something uh, useful in hand? And no silly stun rods and stuff. All right, gentlemen, we are in this uh, for the species. We win. We continue. If we lose, Axcom dies. I think I have built the base correctly though, they will come from the axis lift and the hangars, which is over here. Which means we have a giant bottleneck right here. And Mofatu doesn't spot anything. Mm, I can set them up for reaction fire, but it's dangerous. They might bring stuff like blaster launches and crap like that. Yeah, oh dear. <laughs> Looking at the chat. This is, uh, this is nasty. This is incredibly, horribly nasty. Oh, you're expandable. Cyber discs. Great. It's gonna be, oh shit, that means it's sectoids. Oh shit, that means they have psionic attacks and crap like that. Holy shit. How do I do this? Let's think a little. Because I've made this uh, beautifully uh, bottlenecked, but at the same time it means that I only have one access point um, to the aliens. I can set up lots of reaction fire, and I suppose... But uh, if this lasts too long, they'll start messing with our heads, and my guys will start shooting each other. So, there is that. We have some expendable guys though. The non-named guys. You guys will take the front. And the named guys will just hang back and hopefully react. Yeah, just to cycle through all the people, get them into positions. This is gonna be our main firing lane, and we're just gonna move up uh, until, <laughs> you know, I've run out of soldiers. Yeah, I'm not gonna count on reactions. Don't worry. If this cyber disc comes floating up here and dies here, it will kill all the people. It'll be uh, hilarious. At least our commander is in a sort of safe spot on the side there. Actually, I'm not sure if I like building the base like this. I've just copied it from other people's Let's Plays because they think it's a good idea. But at the same time, you kind of just screwed yourself because, you know, you only have one point of attack. And if they do come with Psy soldiers like this, with psionics attacks and shit, you just, you, you can't really react fast enough. You can't throw your men at them quickly enough. I don't think I'll ever do that again, to be quite honest. Because I don't like it. I just decided that. Yeah, let's get to the guys to the front. This is going to be a very boring turn. It's just moving guys uh, to the bottleneck. Kelaja. Mm, let's not put you in the center there. Got plenty of people here already. Mr. Kastler. Juju, there you are. I bet it looks just like you. There is Mr. Soul. 
Comrade is in position. Linzu, move up. There's the good doctor. Mr. O'Leara, uh, move south, Scruffy. And that's the end of a very boring turn. Here comes the side attack, guys. Wow! Alright, that's, that's a nobody that died, that's fine. These doors, though. We need a, a designated guy to open those doors. That's a blaster launcher. Yes, it is. Another nobody. That's, that's the guy with the blaster launcher. I don't know what he's doing. He's gonna die though. If we do survive this mission, that means that we have blaster launchers that we can investigate. Which is kind of cool. Um, we need a nobody to open those doors. I'm not too sure what to do here. I hate this. I hate how we set up this base. Mavato is far from a nobody, but we need somebody to open these doors. It's gonna be you, my friend. The problem is that you're then in the line of fire. Let's have this guy move up. Yeah, we're just gonna wait another turn. We're just gonna wait another turn and move up these gentlemen right here. At least we killed the guy with the blaster launch you. No, you're not nobody. I told you. Damn it. I'll put the words in my mouth. I suppose we can just go like this for a bit. These guys can react. And if I cluster up too much, they will have blaster launches and nasty stuff. They can't use the blaster launches in the first couple of turns though. Yeah, there's, there's really not much you can do. Let's hope you live so next turn you can open this door and then people can start firing in. You can react, you can react, you can react. Alchemist died, damn it. That's a reaction fire shot, that's good. Nice. React some more. Beautiful. No! Damn it, Sothos. We have another one of you though. Yeah, I hate the construction of this base this way. Super loose on alien control. The shit starts right now. Oh, that that's two softwares down in one turn. Alright, nicely done. Step aside. I know Super Lou is, is in the way here. Um we can't just kill him, I suppose. I don't, I'm not sure if we have grenades. This is a nobody, but we'll try and kill the Cybertus with him. If we kill the Cybertus, uh, it'll, it'll blow up. Nice. And, oh yeah, our, our rookie was still pretty damn close. All right, at least that uh, that helped a bit. We still have the problem of Super Lou though. I can't kill him, but I think they'll mind control another one. So I'm not too sure what to do with you. You're wearing a perfectly good power suit too. Otherwise, I think I would kill you. Now we need to get that door open. If you can get that door open, we can just, you know, have a view on the hangar. Yeah, I don't like this bottleneck. These missions start taking too long now. We're gonna get mind controlled all over the place and wiped out. If this was floaters, it would be easier. We just set up these corridors and let them come. But because, specifically because they have mind control, this is pretty bad. We might have got lucky and... No, no, no. We didn't get lucky. Leaders are still out there. Probably several of them looking at the, the amount there. Super Lou's freaking out. It's all going to shit. 
Holy shit. We see four. Hmm. Always shoot at the guy in the back, he might get lucky and kill two. There's another guy with a blaster launcher there. Bye bye. Luckily you're a nobody. Nice. Yeah, that's another blaster launcher down. It gives me some peace. Hmm. That's not very handy. It's 11. How much do I need? 15 for a snapshot. 17. Can you hit him from here? No. 16? You need 15? Good shot! <laughs> Nicely done, Horst. Wow, that was like, you know, precision work. Our brave commander! Will this be the mission where he meets his demise? Oh, hello. Cyberdisc. I know I'm gonna bottle up these guys for a blast launch shot to the face, but we gotta get our guys in there, we gotta get them in there quick, so let's just run. Let's hope the middle guy doesn't get mind controlled or something silly like that. Luckily we don't have the grenades, at least I don't think we have them on them. Yeah, this is gonna go ugly in a hurry. Maybe I should park you guys behind these little uh, bits of cover. Maybe that'll help. You feel dizzy? Sorry. Incoming blaster launches next round. Yeah, I know. The two turns of non-explosives have expired, so... Blaster launches are becoming real. And so are these cyber discs. We blew a hole in the wall there. In the... Um, in the door. Which means uh, they can fire through and we can fire through. Let's get the guys in there. Juju, we might need your precision gunnery. You know, good sniper, so we might actually put you to use. We got a Lingzu. Probably should take the sides and not the front. Alright, let's hope they don't do the blaster launcher thing here. Horse is under alien control. They shot the Fatu. Horse killed uh, a nobody. Could have gone, gone worse. So Could have gone worse. That was not too shabby. Goodbye, Horst. You became a liability to the organization. No line of fire, really. We need somebody to open the door. Brave commander. I like it. Let's hope you don't get killed by friendly fire. Mm. Ooh, that was very close to killing Lonstone. Nice. I think that Cyber just killed his buddy and then everything just exploded. Comrade, come on, finish it off. Nice. Now we have a problem though, because all of the smoke will obscure our vision. And the charge is very real. There is another cyber disk right there. Yeah, let's just let's just keep on charging. We need to get our guys in there. We need to get them in there quick. Juju is making it to the front. The leader is still up there, but he didn't control anybody. I think we killed one of the leaders. Because it was a le lot less Psy attack than previously. Alright. Plenty of Psy with this for everybody. 
Uh, let's not stand in the fire. I don't think that's wise. Oh, actually, this is not on fire. Okay. <laughs> Scurvy paid the price for that rookie. <laughs> Sorry, Scruffy. That was pretty funny. <laughs> oh! Never mind. Uh, let's have our commander just hang back a bit. If he dies, the morale will be horrible. But yeah, this smoke is not helping. Not one bit. This door will close, right? Ducky, Juju, I need you guys in just a sec. We're gonna try and get through the smoke. We're gonna spread out in two different directions and try and clean them out. Which means I need more soldiers too. I need everybody, really. Like I said, we're in it for the species. Hey, Snakey. Good evening to you too. Alright, I know you're a bit of a wuss, but get your gun and get to the front. Now everybody with a power suit should definitely get here too. Run! Super Lou is in. Is this everybody? Is this uh, everybody that's left? Yep. Yeah. Alright guys, these are the numbers that we have. One blast to launch a bomb right here and we are pretty much screwed. Okay, power suit saved you. Not sure if I have a med kit uh, available for you somewhere. How many fatal wounds do you have? Two. So you got, what is it, eight turns to live and you die on the ninth? Okay. Look at that. This guy is a stun launcher. I know this probably screwed you over because now you cannot move anymore. But we'll try and save you. Lingzu will try and save you. With some horrible gunnery skills. Hmm. Rookie aim! There we go! Yeah, definitely lots of rookie aim there. Jesus. I'm just gonna pile up my guys here, I suppose. No, not with Lonstone, though. Because this is asking for a blaster launch around to the face. Alright, at least we killed one. Kessler. You can get there with 12, that's not enough. You can get there with 16, you can fire once. Do power suits actually consume more time units? Yeah, you can't, I can't move you. I really screwed you over there. 21. And then you can auto shot. But I think you'll, you'll probably kill Comrade there. Damn it. You can only do a snapshot. Yeah, your Comrade is in the way. Alright, back off. Um, I think that alien will just live. But there's plenty more on this side. <laughs> You're not even a rookie. You have rookie aim. Holy shit. Step away. Can we make this shot maybe? I suppose we can. Yeah. With every sectoid we kill there is a chance that it is the leader. And I'm quite happy to just murder them at this point. I'm not gonna try and stun them or pull any crazy stuff. Uh. Step away from the side of this. Mm, no, that's Ducky down. I suppose this is not an angle Juju can make. That was a misclick on my part. Sorry, Juju. That was uh, excellent gunning, but mm, sloppiness on my part. Oh, yeah. Mind control, guys. Problem solved. 
And we need a med kit for Super Elu here. Anybody? Nobody? I just moved the one guy with the med kit, didn't I? Put it on the floor. And now you can't move. <laughs> Alright. You can get your med kit. And John here will help you out. And you guys just keep running. Yeah, Soul is heartless. You just kill them in cold blood. The good news, guys, is after this mission, you all get new soldiers. Assuming we don't die horribly in a big ball of fire. We still have Kalaja here. You thought I forgot about you, didn't you? I actually did, but you're getting to the front right now. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm gonna try and keep you alive. Damn it! No! No, guys, come on, it was just a little grenade. It's just a little grenade, there's nothing going on, really. It's alright. It's cool. It's just a grenade. I know Lonestone's gonna get shot in the back by that cyber disc, but this guy needs to die. And we needed a kill to get morale back up. Because, uh, yeah, everybody's freaking out. John Cobb, however, is not. He's as sturdy as one can be. And O'Lira, here, look at this. This guy is not freaking out at all. He's, he's like, peace and calm. And he's just gonna murder the cyber this game. Or maybe not. Mm, no, he got killed himself. He tried to do the right thing and raise morale, but... Yeah, he died a hero's death. This rookie has a bravery of 60, it's pretty cool. Alright guys, that's it. We killed all the leaders though. So once you guys start freaking out, we can actually kill that cyber disc and be done with it. Um, get a gun from this pile of rubble here please. Juju, it's time to be a hero. Mm, and you're a dead Juju. But you did an awesome scouting job, so Kastler here can kill this thing. That was nice. I was kind of hoping that would be the last guy, but it's not. There are more aliens to be fried. However, not in this hangar. Which means they're over here. Yeah, get a gun please. Make yourself useful. Kalaj is freaking out. Super loose, bleeding and running. Well, at least we know exactly where we can find them now, which is gonna help. I mean, it's not like we have to hunt through the entire base for the last alien. There's no way. Oh, the last guy came past us. Uh, nobody died. Soul's berserking again. And he's over here, we know that. There he is. I think there's two left. Oh, wow, that's it. Haha. <laughs> Cool. 24 XCOM <laughs> operatives killed, which I think is a record for me in any mission. But uh, lots of equipment out of this one. It's not all bad, really. But uh, yeah, they do know where our base is, which is not ideal. 24 soldiers died, so let's just order 30 back. Uh, let's go on a selling spree here and let's salvage what we can out of this more horrible disaster. It could have gone worse though. We could have lost the entire base and with that uh, the playthrough. Because bouncing back from that is mm, pretty hard. If not impossible. And the good news is we have a blaster launcher out of all of this. So there is stuff for us to research now. 
But it will be a while before our Sky Ranger can take off. <laughs> I suppose after all of this crap and going on, Lonstone is still alive, which is also a bit of good news. And we can rename uh, these two soldiers before the, the rest comes in. I suppose, you know, if there's a mission pops up, I can send in, what is it, seven guys or something? Um, let, let's see, who died? Who's chatting right now? Did O'Lira survive? No, he did not. You'll get your soldier. And this is an awesome rookie, by the way. I think this was the one that didn't panic when, like, five guys died because of the grenade. He's got a kill. He's got his first little combat just, you know, right around the corridor of his sleeping quarters. Well, Dacarino's still watching. I see a chat. But, uh, yeah, I think it'll be like 72 hours or something, yeah, before they come in. So that's, uh, what is it, three days? And until that time, we have seven guys in the Sky Ranger. With only five medkits. Seven guys can clean up a mission, though. Especially because we have power suits that give those. Alrighty. How long are these guys wounded? Super Lou is out for 27 days. Wow. We'll, we'll give you a second one. And Badge is out for only 9. Let's hope the aliens take a little breather. Very small, so yeah, stuff like that we can handle. Sweet! We don't have the money for uh, this just yet, but th this is awesome that we have this. We have 8 million. I suppose we can sell some crap if we need it. And these things should be built ASAP. These things are like the improved radar system. They got, um, I think, the same range, maybe a little bit bigger. And they give us all the information about the UFO. They give us its mission, basically, which is very important. It means we know if it's going to land or if it's going to try and find our base and retaliate. I need, I need some money here. Wow, we actually pulled this off. Hyperwave decoders are uh, are real. Awesome. I'm still building power suits. And that takes up a little bit of money. How long? How long? How long? 39 hours. Of course, they send a medium. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Seven guys! Seven guys! In power suits. Against the medium. These might be sectoids. So, uh, if it is sectoids, it's the most dangerous mission ever because there will be a leader. But it's also an opportunity, I suppose. Yeah, we l we're gonna lose this one. And this is a different one, okay. I would be nuts to, pl to play this, wouldn't I? I'm looking at you guys in the chat. Am I nuts if I want to play this? Because this thing will land. It's a medium. It's going to harvest or something. Or I can just blow it out of the sky and let it rot, I suppose. Or maybe play it once the, the reinforcements get here, if, if there's time. Alright, Charlie. That might be your cookie. You should at the very least shoot it down. Let's spread these guys out a bit. You can only find them every half hour. There it is, it's on the ground. Oh wow, we totally missed this one. And another one. Three. Holy hell.
The aliens know that we're hurting. <laughs> so they just sent all of their, uh, their uh, what is it, the doctor, I think? Yeah. Alright, that's over the ocean, so that's calm. And this thing is landing as well, holy hell. You say play it during the day? Hmm. With seven guys during the day? And if I see a sector, just run, go. Yeah, I know I'm nuts. <laughs> Thank you for pointing that out. <laughs> well, basically, it's sectoids of float. As if it's sectoids, there's the leader, which is an opportunity. But with seven guys, only one of you needs to get mind control, and it's over. I think I'm gonna wait and not be nuts, because this this particular playthrough is fun. It's been rough as hell, and I kind of want to finish it successfully. So I'm gonna do the smart thing for a change and wait for the guys. There you guys are, excellent. This will take some time, gentlemen, because it's a big naming ceremony. I'm gonna look at the chat constantly and rename people. So, Alira, Docarino, Lonstone. Here you go. I know that you keep chatting now. It's say me, me, me in the chat and stuff like that. So I know who needs soldiers. And I know who's out there. I think we lost the collage, didn't we? Who else needs one? Who else died? I don't keep track of these things. Mafatu died, I remember him blowing up. Who else? Horst. You got mind controlled? And then shot in the face. Super loose as me me me. Oh, that's a uh, bit too enthusiastic. I think we did Mafatu just a second ago. Uh, Kastler? Five aces. Did you just come online, sir? If so, you got awesome timing. Did Sol die? I don't think Sol died. No. He lived through it with three kills. Ten bravery. <laughs> what a chicken shit. Uh, the new Juju is awesome, by the way. Uh, let's see. Five aces. Uh, Borgman. Ah, so that's your name on Twitch. Welcome, sir. Who else? Oh yeah, comrade. Sorry, man. Of course. And I keep forgetting that last bit. Sue for Roth. Uh, you did die. Yes, you did. Now there's two of Kilaja. All right. Well, th that'll be corrected by itself. Mafatu, I did. Suvorov is in. Who am I missing here? <laughs> Face the wrath of the Soviet Empire. I think I did Suprilo. Didn't I? Yeah, there's not two Suprilos. Which is fine, I suppose. I can do some double ones. There's two Kalajas, so might as well. Let's do another Juju. If he's still watching. I don't see him chatting anymore, actually. Mm, Olira died. Yeah. No, he didn't. We still have him here. I think I'll leave it at this. Uh, let's get the guys on the craft. Uh, there should be only one Kalaja on the mission. Horse to the front. Uh, Super Lou's in there. Five aces. Welcome, sir. Uh, the comrade. Porkman, who just came in. And uh, that's 14. I like it. We have the officers uh, at the back with the power suits. <laughs> and Borgman can have one. Uh, yeah, we're good to go. Did we get more grenades out of this? No, we didn't. I think by the time we get here it will be day, so we can play this medium at the very least. And they often have medics in them. So it might be worthy to stun a few here. 
This might be a really funny mission. If it's not by day, I don't think it's gonna be. Uh, you should patrol. We don't need to keep this thing targeted. So it doesn't disappear on us. There we go. Cool. We need money, but we can set up a second Sky Ranger right here. And guys, this might be uh, an opportunity here. Did I get a new Scruffy in? I probably did not. And I see Scruffy still in the chat. Yeah, you'll get a new one. Just please remind me after this mission. We need the stun rods in this one, so I'm going to take some time to arming the troops. There might be a sector leader here, which is a grand prize. Why are some people hugging all the clips and not giving any clips to other people? It's very mean. If there is a sector leader here, he'll be at the top in his office. He'll mind control the crap out of us. And even if I bring uh, that guy back home, which is one soldier alive, it's worth it. So you guys know your place. It's floaters. We can kill all of these guys uh, indiscriminately. Comrade! You survived. And it only took you six shots to get a kill. <laughs> nice. Uh, there's not going to be any Illyrium left in this thing from the looks of it. Five aces. Nice. Yeah, you can get a soldier on both Sky Ranges. I actually like that idea. I'm never going to have enough viewers to like fill oil, everything. Damn it, my fat was down. One of the jujus. Oh, you see him. That was three hits if that guy took it, with only 54, wow. No, horse, the doctor doesn't always have floaters, sometimes they have sectoids. I'm 100% sure of it. It's often floaters though, that is true. Good luck! I'll have a sip of my wine. I haven't had a sip in this entire stream. Okay, that could have gone worse. Not bad. You hit him once. And now you kill all, all of them. <laughs> nice killing spree there, Super Lou. <laughs> that was beautiful. Yeah, I thought as much. This guy has a heavy plasma, which is bad news. You can probably get even further back. Mm, Sol is at least somewhat experienced, so we can set up a bit of a firing line with him, I suppose. And we can even step in through the sides here. That's pretty cool. Galaja! No line of fire. Please make one. Beautiful! That was, that was absolutely gorgeous. That was sexy. Eh, you can't kill him, I think. This might work. It does! At least you hit him once. Juju, my good man. I don't think you'll be able to throw a grenade there, but I'm gonna try. If it fails though, you got a prime grenade in hand. Not bad, that actually worked. Better than expected. Mr. Kassler has the sneaky way. And 
Mr. Comrade here, you go up the hill and aggressively scout. Wow, you actually find something. I did not expect that. And I actually didn't whine, want to find anything there. Sol cannot throw a grenade. Borgman can. I got 36 time units. 25 is 37. Damn it. <laughs> um. Yeah, never mind. Johnny doesn't have a grenade. I suppose we can chuck it to Johnny. And then chuck it over there. Because I think he's on the outside. Yeah. It's going to be a bit of an awkward throw. Out of range. Hmm. Well, you're walking uh, time bomb now. If you get killed, it will explode. So everybody step away from Mr. John. And let's hope. That's basically what we do. We hit end of turn and we hope. Good reaction fire. I think that was Sol. And there goes Kastler. Ah, you took the sneaky way. Yeah, you see that guy. Yeah. Five aces, that's your cookie. Horst had a dangerous job there. And uh, now five aces has that job. Although, maybe... Maybe... No, I don't think so. We're gonna try. The comrade could not finish it off. That door will close, so the alien will lose the line of sight. Mm, maybe Sol can get lucky here. 25. Nice! Ah, oh, come on, that guy should have died. Sol did not get lucky. Super Lou! Well, Sol took all the reaction fire there, so. Let it rip! This is a very dangerous corner, actually, because the aliens can come out here. Juju, watch it. Well, Lyra can do some more aggressive scouting on this side. Yeah, excellent. Good scouting. Mm, don't like the finish much. The scouting was pretty good. Step out of his line of sight, please. Mm. There's no way you can chuck the grenade there. No. Um, step away from everybody, please. As long as you don't move too much. Oh, Ducky's still at the, at the back here. And of course, a brave commander. Alright. We hope again. You know, if you don't have a line of sight, you can just admit it, instead of just hammering away, you know? It's no shame. This might work, actually. How much do you need? 19? 21? 23? Damn it. A line of fire. You do have a grenade. No time to prime it, though. Hmm... Yeah, our brave commander carving in the Sky Ranger. Apparently you can see an alien up here. Somewhere. Where? There! Not happy with the position here at all. I was just that's probably the reason I'm a bit quiet at the moment. I'm just messing up everything and I hate my placement. Ah well, people are gonna die, that's what it is. I'm just hoping the guys in power suits will at least survive, because you know, the equipment costs money. Power suits don't grow on trees. All that jazz. You didn't need to step inside there as soon as you saw them. Oh. 
Solo might have 10 bravery, but he's a killing machine. He's getting all the kills. 16. 15. Eh, never mind. I think he hit Olera. Not sure. Nah, I, he's fine. Even if he di did get hit. Ducky! This one is yours. Nice. Uh, Mr. Porkman has a, has a chance here now. No dice. Not too sure what to do with you, really. Apparently you don't have a line of sight, but you do see him. Which is weird. And I can't blast my way through Illyrium. Uh, sorry, alien alloys. I probably should not risk you. And just bring the guys up. Actually, I could have used you for the lift. I should have used you for the lift. There we go. Yeah, equipment costs money, damn it. <laughs> That's the problem. The dead cost nothing. The equipment costs money. Well, actually, there's like 10,000 per soldier or something, right? What is it, 40,000? I don't even know. I do not check these things. The navigator is flipping out, which is good news, which means Galazia can just... Um, we can stun him, I suppose, but there's no point. We already have a navigator. Damn it. Borgman is seriously hurt here. But at least it's the last guy. We lost three, no alien... Uh, sorry, no Illyrium, but... Meh. There should be enough um, loot here to get the Sky Ranger and the guys for the second base, which is exactly what we need. Mm, let's see. There's already one Kalaja up there, so we'll have Kastler in there. There's already a Super Elu in there. And there's also a Juju in there, so... You know... I'm gonna get rid of some duplicates. Uh, Scruffy was in there. Who else needed one? Please say it in chat if your soldier has died. I'm gonna get rid of the duplicates because I think I have plenty of viewers to do this. Lundstone. Oh, wait, you have to come on there still. Malketh, welcome, sir. Horst? Didn't I just do Horst? Alright. Mm, Kalaja's still in there, I know that. With uh, one guy on the Sky Ranger. Who else do we need? Yeah, needless bonding indeed, Ducky. But, uh, I'm a commander, I need to like professionally detach myself from the troops on the field. Otherwise, I'm, I'll make mistakes based on emotional responses. We can't have that. So you guys are all dead to me, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> is this it? I think this is it. I'm still have plenty to rename, so we should be alright for a bit. Borgman's in there. Du -du 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 -du. And I should make sure that the guys that are watching are actually on the Sky Ranger. Which means Soul's off, and Scruffy's on. And Mofatu's on. And Melkith's on, and Horst's on. There you go. Horst did an accident, yeah. It's fixed though. Horst's back in, and he's in the front row. And he's even gonna get a power suit. Because the front guys really should get some protection, I suppose. You can face tank some plasma, that's always good. Selling! That was what we're gonna do. But no small launches on that uh, harvester. Interesting.
Nice, that'll do. Let's get the Sky Ranger. Uh, let's give it um, the bare minimum of 30 soldiers. Yes, and of course it needs stuff to shoot with. Africa base is almost in business. Love it. 24 days till happy with Dakotas and we're nearly broke. I suppose you can sell some alien alloys. Give the boys in manufacturing a little bit lean way. I want more workshops and stuff like that. Actually, there's lots of stuff I want, but yeah, we need money. This was the only crash site we had left from those mediums, so... Actually, I should um, save the, ga the game. You never know when it's gonna crash or my PC might have a power outage and stuff like that. There is an autosave though, which helps. Charlie, take it down. Oh, no! Ah! It landed! Panic! Night mission though, but it is a small one. Ah, no, it's, it's, it's going up. Hi, Captain K! Monsieur Captain, let's immediately give you a soldier. Can I change the order of the soldiers on this screen too? No, okay. Uh, this will be perfect. Yeah, it's by date. Let's clean it up. There's no need to take names or uh, take prisoners. This is uh, kill them all. And Malkith's first step. Is not his last. Wow. You are a professional face tanker, sir. Wow. I like you. Holy hell. You took that to the face like a pro. Not bad, Scruffy. Make some room. Our brave comrade. I don't think I did the order of the soldiers uh, by rank. I should do that. Ah, oh, there comes the comrade. Horst, take his place. <laughs> Four bloody aliens in this building right here. Ah, uh, Malkus died because horse moved, and now horse died as well. <laughs> oh shit! Do you know what these power suits cost? Damn it! Brave Castler. At least you hit him. That was good. Can't ask for more than that. And these aliens will run out of reaction fire at some point. And hopefully before I run out of soldiers. Nice. Can you fire again? No. Make room then. There's five aces here has a job to do. And he intends to do it well. Not bad for some uh, sort of rookie aim. Can you uh, step out of the way please? Yes, thank you. Kilaja! Entropy, Sergei, whatever. Uh, there's a guy in the way. 21? Yeah, that'll still work. Nice! Alright, that's four aliens down <laughs> in the first bloody building here. Are there more buildings? Mm, doesn't look like it. That's good. There we go. I don't think Juju is watching anymore, so when this uh, Juju dies, it will be the last Juju. Ducky's doing well, isn't he? This particular incarnation. And our brave commander. Yes, he'll leave the Sky Range eventually, but only on the second wave. So. 
first our guys will move out, spread out a bit, and then the commander will follow them at a distance. A safe distance. So he doesn't get shot in the back by ambitious soldiers wanting to take his place. I'm totally expecting to find something right now. It's too quiet. Five aces bravely taking the front. I think this particular incarnation of Juju was uh, surprisingly brave. And John Cobb is also on a run. He's a sergeant by now. He might miss this entire stream, but his soldier is definitely kicking ass. Commander doing some scouting. Old school. Yeah, <laughs> horse keeps tripping on his way out of the sky range. Well, Malkith tanked that greatly, though. I think that guy alone absorbed, what, seven plasma before he kicked the bucket? That was impressive. I always appreciate a good uh, face tanking soldier. One that doesn't care about his looks. He doesn't mind to be in the infirmary for 30 days if he actually lives through it. Damn right, the old school is the best school. That's why we play these games, after all. I can't believe 40, 24 guys died on that base defense mission. That, that's, I think that's a record for me. I don't think I've ever lost more than 20. It's a pretty special occasion, really. You guys were there for it. Tell your kids! 24 people died and we still won the mission. Damn it! There was a door. Which means there are aliens on that side, right here. Hmm. I could throw a grenade, just, you know, preemptive strike. I'm pretty sure Ducky agrees. <laughs> Gambled and won. Let's see who else is volunteering here. Um, Lonstone might actually see some action. Uh, Ducky already moved. We got Kastler here. And John. Yep. Since John's not watching, his soldiers should actually just take some dangerous moves. Alright, let's just peek occasionally. Leave it at that. Our brave commander is going to see some action. Otherwise, Lonstone will be bored watching this. Nothing yet. We'll catch one. There we go. I know this works. This is a problem though. Better. Ah, that's it. Okay, we lost three guys and that was totally unnecessary. But then again, there were four bloody aliens in that building to the start. Holy hell. You're not bored at all? Yeah, you must lead by example. That's damn right. Ducky got a promotion. Very nice. Let's see. We got a captain. 
you're in and at the front. And I think uh, we lost some guys, didn't we? How did we lose? I think we lost Horst. So you're back and we lost Malkith. Oh wow, there's a good soldier for Malkith. Look at that firing accuracy. Who else did we lose, guys? There was the third one in there. Who was the third? Oh, the comrade! The comrade! Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, dude. Keep forgetting about you. It's not personal. Uh, see if we're off. Good soldier. Holy hell. Your firing accuracy will need a lot of improvement, but the base stats for the rest, the strength, the bravery, time yeah. units, it all started pretty well. Alright. That'll do. I think I'll take John Cobb out because he's not playing, as not watching, and put the comrade in. And that means you can fork over the power suit and give it to the comrade right away. We got two. Market, you powered power suited up again. I think uh, those two kills uh, really uh, made our commander look a lot better all of a sudden. Yeah, nine kills out of seventeen, and you're steadily improving to be pretty damn awesome. And Captain, welcome, you're in. Let's sell the badly needed stuff we need for money. Mine probes, I love them. Pure gold. I think they're actually made of gold or something, because... They're so nicely expensive to sell. Uh, da -da -da -da. How long before the sky range actually here? 26 hours. A little bit over a day. There it is. Guys, I think you'll like this because you're gonna get a second soldier based in Africa and can then, you know, compare um, the teams. Team Africa is starting out with a bare minimum and no armor whatsoever, but it will see action, especially when we have a second mission to go on. So for now, everybody gets a second soldier. If I forget you, Please make sure you point it out. Wow, that's a great soldier. Alright, that was quick, and who did I forget? I'm pretty sure I always forget somebody. Nobody? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It shows I have twenty-three viewers. Ah, super do. There we go. Who else? Scruffy. And the other takers. All right. Let's leave it at that. One, two, three, four. Ah, this is this is like a full Sky Ranger. It's pretty cool. Yeah, nearly. Can I have two more, mate, please? Can I have two more? Uh, Kessler, yes, sir. And five aces. Thank you, guys. That's a full Sky Ranger right here. That's nearly spelled right. Yeah, Lings is not watching. Oh, no soldier for him. <laughs> well, this is fine. I got a full Sky Ranger. We have a second team. They're unarmored. 
but they are far from harmless. And I've got enough to build like a second workshop and some living quarters. 